Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is just some little project shares. I'm actually starting to work on a swap and this is my first time ever playing with the company Doodlebug. I just, um, I normally just don't gravitate towards the super, super cutesy stuff or the stuff with the eyeballs and stuff. Like, I think that's called kawaii, right? I hope I'm saying it right. But I was obsessed with the little, called Doodle Pops. I like their Doodle Pops, and probably any of the collections. But I've never bought like paper and stuff. So these are the cardstock stickers. So cute. And Christina was selling them. And I was like, okay, maybe I got to get these. These are so cute. The little milk, all sorts of, um, and this collection is called Made with Love. It should be called Baked with Love, but it's called Made with Love. Is this KitchenAid mixer. This is the smaller of the two and it does make a little shaker. So this is what I made and the papers, this paper was very busy. So I had to like back it on a, like a solid color. And then I used one of their little words from the ephemera pack. And then the shaker mix, if you can tell, I used some faux sprinkles from Chaos Craft. And then there's some like cookie polymer clay bits. I felt like this was the perfect time to use all these super cute, like clay bits. I was gonna use gingerbread, but it's not a Christmas swap. So. I ended up not doing that, but I did use the cookies and the fake sprinkles. Adorable. <laughs> okay, so that's that die. I do want to make a bunch more now that I like assembled that. Super cute. Little oldie but goodies, you guys. This is um, baked with love. It's got like a little spatula shaker. And um, this is what it makes. As you can see, it's got the cute little like cupcakes in the background. I went ahead and stitched the entire frame. And this does have the word baked with love, but I felt like it was blocking a majority of the cupcake paper. And then I added those little yellow candy swirls. But um, anyway, when you cut this out in foam, just cut the top of the B and part of the L. And it, I cut out the entire thing. Basically, I just wanted a frame of this. I left the spatula foam piece there, but um, I just cut the words out. That way you don't have to layer up the spatula onto the foam. Um, that's what that's how I like you're able to get the shaker parts to shake all the way across and then the top piece I cut it out on paper and then I just cut around to get the shape of the spatula this is one of the pieces from the ephemera and I just did like little cupcake and wire wrap beads hanging down super cute and here's one where it looks like just the bake with love I didn't embellish the front because like I said it was very busy I did go ahead and stitch it and then I just added this little like dangle charm that was gifted to me by Kayla, Kayla's Crafts. And it just went perfect on this little like loop of the spatula. I didn't have to add jumper, like an eyelet, nothing. So it, this was just perfect for this cute little bow. I know those are from Allie. Cute, right? This die, this is actually a apron box and it comes with the layering pieces, the pouches. It came with like stars and stuff, but. I didn't use all that. So this is the box. I did puff up the layers on some puffy tape on this to give it dimension. So that way I was not able to set an eyelet with the holes because it was just two dimensional and I didn't want it to smash down in the corners. I did add those little doodle pops right here sticking out of the pocket. So I kind of just glued around the pocket. This little bow die is that, bo um, that bow die set from DIY Art Bin Store. And then this was one of the cut aparts. I just made it tinier and cut just the words out and then layered that up. I did stitch the front and then I added <laughs> this trim. This is from Nadezda. She gifted it to me and I just tied it in a little bow, like kind of how like an apron would be. Instead of adding like strings up here, I just added it um, on the side and in the back. And it says craft purge. And then I'm gonna be, I'm gonna make stuff and stick it inside of here. But yeah, those are my cute little doodle bug project so far and I will catch you guys on the next crafty video. Bye guys!